Well, today, 10 News spoke with a San Diego teenager who won the Academy Award for Best Short Documentary last night. Innocente Izucar shared her favorite highlights of the night with 10 News reporter Vanessa Van Hefti. A huge night for Innocente at the Oscars, but in many ways, her story starts here at a facility in National City that helps kids through the arts. It's a modern day Cinderella story. And the Oscar goes to Innocente. From homeless to Hollywood, it's a moment San Diego's Innocente Izocar calls an absolute dream. It's just, you know, like surreal. A year ago, the struggling artist was living in shelters. Last night, she was hobnobbing with the biggest names in Hollywood, a star in her own right. Uh, Daniel Day was kissing twice, so it was pretty cool. But I was a little sweaty, so I felt really bad. <laughs> <laughs> Standing in between the directors who told the story of her life. After her father was deported, Innocente and her family became homeless. In the film, her mother says things got so bad, plans were made for the entire family to jump off the Coronado Bridge. La tomé del brazo y le dije, vente, vámonos para aquel puente que me jaló hacia atrás. Y dijo, mami, no, por favor, no lo hagas. When she was 12, Innocente's talent was discovered here at Arts, A Reason to Survive, which teaches the therapeutic aspects of art. She is a perfect example of how the arts can literally transform a young person's life who may not have any other avenue to do so. Hundreds of calls have poured in here with people wanting to buy her work. Her inspirational story has only just begun. I feel just honored that I can be like the voice for for those who don't have one and I mean I want to do advocacy this year and hopefully inspire more kids that have gone through the same thing. In National City, Vanessa Van Hefti, 10 News. Very inspiring.